Good morning, folks. It is Monday morning. This is Sarah, your socially awkward seller. I am a reseller on eBay, Amazon, Mercari, Poshmark, uh, Etsy, yeah, right, um, and Facebook Marketplace and other things. I don't know, but <clears throat> um, coming to you with another daily vlog. And um, so nothing sold overnight, hmm. um, which is, you know, that happens sometimes, so I don't have anything to show you that sold. Um, but uh, I'm going to try and get all this packaging, the shipping done. I put in a pickup request yesterday for the USPS so that I wouldn't have to go anywhere. Because going to the post office kind of breaks my flow if I'm wanting to list. Because, you know, you have to get out and go dry. You have to actually wear clothes and brush your teeth. Okay, I'll do that anyway. Um, and, you know, get out in the car and go out into the world. And it just, it really breaks my flow. I hit 700 listings yesterday. I want to hit 725 listings today. I'm really going to have to push to do that. So I'm going to go ahead and get the shipping done and uh, just get on it. And let's see how I do. Um, I'll try to bring you guys along a little bit during the day so that this is not a three minute hey, good morning video, and a two-minute, okay, that's the end of the day video. So I'll try to show you guys, like, what I'm doing, or um, we may talk about that freaking Nespresso, Nespresso that I bought yesterday that is trashed, and uh, how I will, you know, what I'm going to part out and what, how much I'll make. So I think that that is probably something I'll go over today. And I should know better than to try and make a video at this time in the morning because my husband always calls me at this time in the morning. So, my fault. I'll take the blame on this one. Anyway, uh, so that's what I plan to do is get my shipping done um, and then just work throughout the morning and try to hit that goal of 25 while still allowing time to do my wife stuff, which fortunately... It's not that heavy today because I just need to vacuum the living room, do a handful of dishes that are left over from tea last night. I've already made the bed, I've already picked up the dirty clothes, so I've got a little bit of laundry to put, put away, dinner to plan, and vacuum the living room. So not bad at all. Um, you know, it, it's this, this, um, I, I always wonder how can a house get so dirty when there's only two people and two cats that live here and my husband is gone like 60, 70 hours a week working? How is it possible? I Am I? Is it me? Oh my, oh my God, is it me? It might be me. Well, I'll just have to live with that, won't I? Um, but anyway, I'll just try to get that stuff done um, along the way today as I can. So, Let's get started. Let's see how I can do um, against my goal, not against, toward my goal of 25 today. All right, I'll check back with you later. So it's just before noon and I'm gonna take a break for lunch, but I have um, 25 drafts. Um, I did not write all of those this morning. And um, the Nespresso debacle that I discussed yesterday where I bought it thinking it was in much better condition then um, it is, uh, will actually turn out okay. If all of the parts sell, um, they should, I should gross about 130 to $150. I give myself that range because the actual total of the parts that I have listed is about 160, but I tend to give generous discounts. So definitely in the 100 plus range, which is more than I would have made selling the entire unit, so I guess I shouldn't be complaining. Um, then I um, finally got around to taking the sewing machine that I bought a long time ago, a month ago or more, uh, out of the box, and I'm going to get that tested this afternoon. And in that box, I found two cords that have nothing to do with the sewing machine, a Dell um, charger, and not Adele. Adele has enough charge, don't you think? She's quite the singer. A charger for Dell laptop computers. 
and um, that's worth about $15 shipped. And um, another Oster um, electric skillet probe, also worth about $15 shipped. Um, I already have one of those listed, so just up up the um, up the quantity. So um, yeah, I am moving right, al right along. Um, I got also today um, the belt for my um, record player. So I'm going to try and get that fixed this afternoon and get that listed as well. And let's just see how it goes because I don't really know. Um, but I am happy so far and I can't really complain. So I'll just try to get some of this stuff cleaned up. The, um, the Nespresso parts are still filthy, so I'm gonna have to take those up and try and clean the lime scale and all that crap off of them. Um, and then I'll take pictures of those and try to get those listed, so. All right, enough talking. I will be back with you guys later. Let's see how I did. Alrighty, it's the afternoon, probably about 3.30. Sandy, get off the thing. Cat, I can't even. Um, and I have put 23 new items up live. Yes. Um, 14 new listings and then 15 new listing, listings. But one of those has nine items. Uh, it's a variation listing. So um, I did that. And I ripped the guts out of a sewing machine. Those were the variations that I put up. The nine uh, items. Um, the sewing machine worked, but it needed some help. Um, but I probably will end up making more money the part parting it out than I will um, with it intact. It'll take longer. I may be a very, very old woman when the last piece sails, if it does. Uh, but it's there in case somebody wants it. And this is a pretty popular sewing machine. So I got that done. Um, I did not wash my... Um, my espresso maker parts yet. Um, I will probably get that done here in a minute. I'm going to take my photo box down and I am going to, um, the cat's running herself into my, himself into my leg. Um, and then I'm going to put away a few things and then I've got to start my wifing upstairs. Um, yeah, so it's been a good day. Uh, oh, I also repaired a, um, record player, put the belt on it. And, um, so I started, you know, put a record on it and then I put the needle on the record and then, um, it started to sound possessed, like a lot of voices talking at the same time. It was very creepy. Felt like it was in some kind of hill house situation or something, but it's because there was actually no needle on the record player. And, um, so whatever was touching was sending sound to the speakers, what, 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 cat, um, was putting sound through the speakers and it was, um, wide. So it was giving me like lots of little chunks of the song. It was a very bizarre thing. I've never seen anything like it. So, um, uh, I went ahead and listed it on uh, Facebook marketplace f at 60 bucks. I'm sure I will get a lot less. Um, and let them know that it needs a needle because I'm not... St Sandy, stop already. Gosh. Just because I won't pet. Um, oh, damn this cat. Um, anyway. I digress. I will tell you that I was able to take the, the platter off of the record player, um, and get the, the belt on and the platter reinstalled and not one curse word fell out of my mouth. I kind of impressed myself, really. So anyway, that was that's how my day kind of looks. I meant to bring you along with me, but you know, I get so involved in what I'm doing, I forget that I need to film some of that stuff because it would have been interesting to show you how to change the belt on this record player. Um, I also removed some lime scale from a boiler, uh, like a double boiler, a glass py a Pyrex one. And, uh, I didn't have any like CLR or anything like that. I just squeezed a lemon into it and it wasn't really heavy calcium. It, it was off in minutes. 
uh, it worked really well. So um, that's not a secret. It's pretty well known that lemon juice or vinegar takes it off, but that worked really well. So anyway, enough rambling. You all don't care. Um, nobody wants to hear me ramble. Uh, that's all I've got today. I've got, I've had one sale today. I'll show you that in the morning. And, um, this cat is making me pet him. This is my life. Um, anyway, the dream works when you do. So keep dreaming, keep working, and I'll see you guys the next time.